I want to be happy and if I if you're not going to make me happy just march and go. Doubles and coffee. I hear a PNM pastor or a PNM who call himself a pastor calling for me to resign because I drink rum and soda on Carnival Monday public holiday. <laughs> me afraid you not saying anything big. Doubles and coffee. I hear a PNM pastor or a PNM who call himself a pastor calling for me to resign because I drink rum and soda on Carnival Monday public holiday. Kambule, Juve, the Monday. I must resign. Really? But I walk out to the Savannah. I walk, went to reach home. Miguel drive me home. I didn't crawl and, and vomit and have no special branch. Drag me into a car. So, Mr. PNM pastor, if you're fine and then should I? should resign because he drink rum on Carnival Monday. Then call for the same thing for Rowley. Because Rowley crawl, Rowley vomit. I too didn't eat nothing. But no big thing. Let's also understand what's your morality, Mr. Um, Pastor. You're talking about that. What about Rowley, Kit Rowley? Because I'm listening now. I want to hear all who to resign. So once Rowley go first, I go follow. No big thing. But what about the, ma the morality, Mr. Pastor? Since you, you have a moral compass all of a sudden calling for people to resign. Now just take note now. PNM, we really don't care what all you say, no, because all of this should come out. But if that is your benchmark, let me use your benchmark for resignation. Then if a man was a teacher like Keith Christopher Rowley back in 1969, and he impregnated a girl of school age, and gave birth to a son that he never claimed until it came out with nonsense, God him. What say you, moral compass pastor, about a teacher who would use his power position to inveigle a girl to give him sexual favors, have sex with that girl, and impregnate her? What about it that is resigned? Well, I really resign first. What about an, a leader of the opposition who would leave his wife and children home, go down in south with Rohan Sinanan and whine on a 17-year-old during the carnival in full glare of everybody? And that 17-year-old just happens to have a HDC house a little year or two later, leapfrogging over 150,000 applicants. What about the, your moral compass, Mr. PNM Pastor, for that? What about a prime minister who has a kind of a junior sport minister in his cabinet and when she goes, his, his wife goes down to help him in his Diego Martin West, he has sexual relations with the man wife. What about the moral compass about that? I'm not here coming to listen. I want to hear, Pastor. I want to hear you quote the Bible that the others attack you and see. And you don't say nothing about Rowley. What about a man who at age 65 would horn his wife without a condom and make twins? What is that moral compass? You have anything to say about that? When Rowley resign, I go resign. And I go walk straight. Me and go crawl and kill Kete and vomit down the place and thing and a special branch dragging me in. What about Rowley moral compass? about having relations with ministers in the cabinet, a deputy in essential, and then promoting them after he had favors, and getting vexed with our next cabinet minister for interfering with he cabinet minister, while the woman husband home trying to take care of the house and the family. What about that, Mr. PNM Pastor? That's okay. You, ju you judging UNC members? You judging Arnold? Boy, rest Arnold, boy. And just... Rhoda Barrett, I hear you say, my face look drunk. Well, Rhoda Barrett, if my face drunk on Carnival Monday and I sleep, I wake up with a sober face. Every night you sleep with that same face. And unfortunately, you just wake up with that same face. All right? So rest me.